Hi guys, and welcome to the Miles Better channel. Today we're going to be looking at Design R ebook program again and another how to video. Hope you're enjoying those. Do check out some of the other videos that I've already posted. Um, but let's dive straight on in. All right, so we're going to look at in this particular video how we can change some of the font sizes, but more importantly, how we can use some of the global changes that are allowed. So we're going to come up into here and we're going to uh, go into settings and you can see here that we could change the font size or the pages size. This is currently set to letter. If we wanted to change it to A4, we can do that. A5, A6. Some people like A6, particularly as lots of uh, books are being read on phones at the moment. However, I quite like using the letter version because I'm using the files to create books to send to people as support information. But again, you can see lots of different options, legal, all the way up to A3 if you're producing posters. But I'm going to leave it on uh, this one for the moment. So we're going to go back up into here. And we're going to come over here and we're going to look at some of the editing function. And this is really what's the power of the ebook processor. Is that we have this ability to make changes to everything. As it says here, we've got make changes to all elements, all right, which is really great. So we're going to keep that as an on function. And as you can see here, we're inside and this is set to 15. So if I start changing this down to 14, you can see that everything is changing in line with the option. So that's really powerful if we know that we want to change the whole book because we've imported and it's come in at a very large font. Again, from um, history and from experience, I've come to understand that 14 PX for the wording is excellent for use on phones, etc. We can also, of course, if we want to, we could change the whole of the fonts. Again, really powerful if you're trying to just lay out your book at the beginning um, of the options, uh, beginning of the sub format. Same with here, we can change the layout, the positioning. We can do these other fun things, which is letter spacing. You can see we can make the words bigger, we can make the words smaller, all affecting every single page. And the same with the line height. So we can do global trans global changes in one go, which is really powerful and a really great tip. Hope you've enjoyed that simple tip. We're trying to keep the tips short and sweet so that you uh, can action them straight away. Um, if you like this tip, then please do share this page, uh, like it, and of course, uh, subscribe using the button below. We look forward to uh, welcoming you back to some of the other videos too. Catch you on the other side.